Hey everybody, this is Super Paper Master with an update video. Now, um, what I want to discuss here is that I'm not doing monthly updates anymore uh, because I find that's kind of useless. When you're doing Let's Plays, for a few months it's going to be always the same game every week that you're uploading. For example, Mario RPG started in June, June 6th to be precise, was when the first episode was uploaded. And now we're August 22nd, I believe, and we're at episode 44, and later today I'm uploading 45 and 46. So, that's kind of useless doing that. I'm mostly just doing this video because there's actually something important. So I will be doing update videos when there's something actually really important that's going on. So what's going to be happening from now on is that uploads will be on Monday instead of Tuesday. They were on Tuesday because I took summer classes in college to catch up. It was really good because I got to finish French forever, no more French, and I suck at French. And I did the fourth English because in college, for some weird reason, once you do first and second English, you could go and do the fourth English. So I did that, and I'm going back to do the third English, and then you could take the English exam exit exam. Don't ask me how that works, but it works and I'm happy because I finished that big essay at the end of the fourth English, which still obviously I have no idea how I passed it because it sucked like crap. So that's good that that's done and I passed those two courses, so that's two courses out of the way for the rest of my life. So uploads during that time went on Tuesday because that's the only time when I actually had time. Monday, Wednesday I had English till five and the other two days my sister had to use the computer her because again I'm gonna say this again my computer's movie maker for some reason doesn't want to upload videos to YouTube so I have to record it from my computer transfer it via uh, my UBS key to my sister's computer to upload it to YouTube don't ask me why my computer doesn't want to do it because I tried there was this video I tried like five times and every single time it failed so you know when you're using 30 minutes to upload a video you really don't want it to fail and my sister's computer it never fails so I'm just using her so I'm Thursdays and Fridays she needed to use it for whatever her summer courses were because she took some too so yeah so that's the only time I actually had time to upload videos during the summer and I just kept it like that because I found that Tuesday was a pretty good day to upload videos and occasionally there was a video that was uploaded on Friday or Saturday you know so it was pretty good but now the thing is my schedule for the fall semester I have four courses on the Tuesday and I finish at 5.30 and I really don't think I'm going to feel like uploading videos when I get home so uploads will move to Monday Monday I finish at 2.30 so I could at least try and upload one video if I can upload both videos I will upload the other one during the week Friday also finish early I would like to save Friday to actually record footage but if worse comes to worse I could do that the weekend and I'll upload the other video on Friday because I actually have time as for Wednesdays I start at 2 30 I don't want to up take a chance and upload that day because if I have to leave I don't want the computer to just be sitting there and uploading and stuff you know because I don't like it if other people like go in this house to go and go on my YouTube and go mm, what's this or whatever and mess something up you know I'd rather just be here from point A to Z when I'm uploading so yeah so that day is not that great I'm not gonna upload that day but I'll edit videos because editing videos really doesn't take that much time when you have a lot you takes longer because you want to try and do all of them but I could at least do a few uploads there and if I don't have any to edit I mean not uploads I was I mean edit in videos uh, anyways and if I don't have any to edit wouldn't after I'll actually just probably play video games or something because there's a few that I would like to do a let's play of which I haven't beaten the game yet so I will have to do that before I actually um, start doing a let's play of that game um, yes also oh, um, yeah uh, after Mario RPG is over which will be maybe early than I probably think because I was probably thinking end of October 
beginning of November that it would be end finished. And I'm thinking that maybe it would finish before that because there's not really much episodes left to upload. For, if I'm doing 45 and 46 uploading that today, this may be... Wait... Yeah, it's maybe just 10 episodes after 46. So that would probably be over maybe around the, the start of a end September, start of October, I'm guessing. So that might be ending around that time. So it's much earlier than I thought it was, like a month earlier than I thought it was going to end. And that's also because I did a few uploads on Fridays and Saturdays, you know. Um... So what's left to record is the final boss battle. Everything else is recorded. So that's up to episode like 53 that's recorded. And there's just the final boss battle, which is probably going to be in two parts. And the end credits, which is going to be its own episode. So among 56 episodes, I'm guessing. And after that, when I record those, that boss battle, I'll also there's something else I have to record. But that's going to be getting uploaded like in the far future because I have that's there's seven tins I have to seven tins I have to record and this is the third one I'm actually recording so it might take a while before that actually gets uploaded but yeah I'm not gonna say anything about that yet ah, excuse me and I'm also gonna be doing uh, tests with my DS I don't think I'll be able to do DS games. I'll still have to check that because it depends. Because I could film the top screen, but I can't film the bottom screen because I have this small um, tripod. I have a bigger tripod, but that tripod doesn't make the camera tilt down at an angle, so I can't record the DS from a higher angle. But I have a small one I bought for a daughter, and I can't tip it all the way because then the camera's too heavy, so it tips over. But I could put it. There's a way I could put it like halfway, and that I could film the top screen but not the bottom screen. So I might be able to do DS games, but you'll only see the top screen. But then it's going to be still hard for me because I'm going to have to look at the bottom screen and look at my TV where there's going to be the top screen. Because that's what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be doing tests with the DS for Game Boy Advance games. Because I could film the top screen, that's where I put the Game Boy Advance game is on the top screen it goes. I could put out the bottom screen, but I liked it more on the top. So I could film the top screen, and I'm gonna actually put that to my TV. Yeah? So I could see it. I could watch it on the big screen instead of on the small screen and have the camera in the way. And then that will go to through the Dazzle to my computer. And the reason I just I originally was just gonna film it via the camera, but if I do it that way, I might get it in better quality because I saw the quality from the camera like when I filmed I filmed a bit of a um, of a Game Boy Advance game on my camera and I put it onto the computer and the quality was very very bad and I'm like I could always upload these if, uh, Game Boy Advance games because it was just a test but I wasn't going to upload that but I mean like once I start recording Game Boy Advance games but I'm like the quality isn't great and I don't think people will want to watch a video with that quality so I'm gonna see how it's gonna work if I use my usual setup that I use for um, like RPG and those uh, council systems and I'll see if I could get better quality that way and if I can't well at least I tried but I really think I could get better quality because usually from the TV it records in HD but then after it doesn't go to YouTube in HD for reason but anyways so anyways it's it's a pretty it might not work but it could be better quality hopefully it could be a if it's a bit better quality you know at least it's better than it would have been so I'm gonna be doing tests with that because the next game after Mario RPG I'm not saying what it is but it's a Game Boy Advance game and it's also a Mario game and that's an entertainment uh, Game Boy Color and Game Boy, uh, the first ones. I do have a few of those games. I want to do Let's Plays of them, but they can't go into DS, so I might have to use my Game Boy Advance, and I'm not sure if I'll be able 
to use a camera because we're in a DS is like this oh screen went black uh, it's like this like okay yeah you know it goes like open close like this so I could film the top screen with the camera by putting it at a certain angle but I can't from the bottom screen and the Game Boy Advance is flat like this so I'm not sure if I'll be able to actually record a Game Boy Advance game a Game Boy Color game Game Boy Advance I'm okay so I hope I can and if I find a way to from the bottom screen of the, 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 of the DS it should be okay but I think wait a minute uh, yeah I think I will be able to do that I just thought of a way yeah I'll be able to use my Game Boy Advance and if that works for the Game Boy Advance it might work for the DS but I don't think I'll do DS games because it will be hard to actually film the two screens so I might not do that but if there's a game where it's mostly focused on one screen because there's one game like Super Mario 64 DS for one good example one screen I don't know if it's the top or the bottom but one screen is just the map of the area so you guys don't really have to see the map it just shows you where you are and where the star is so it, it's not really that important to see the map. It's more important to see where the characters go in and what I'm doing. So if there's a game like that, it'll be good because I could just quickly look at the, the screen with the map on and go, okay, that's where the star is. And I already know that game really well. So for because I have the N64 version, so I could just check the map for the stars that are, are not in the N64 version and still get to do the game pretty well um, like other games maybe like Golden Sun I think the top screen is just like some items that when you're selling at the shop I think and is like the, the gin and your HP levels however that's more important because I have to see the HP levels in boss battles because if I don't forget to heal I could die so I don't know how we're gonna do DS games but it could happen if it works because I just thought of a way and it was pretty good timing that I just went I'm just talking like ah wait I could do it like that so yeah and is there anything else that was mostly what I wanted to talk about so yeah I guess that's it so and this video is like 13 minutes long, so if you're still here, thank you for watching the whole video. And um, yeah, there'll be more videos on Mondays, and if there's not two videos on Monday, it'll be on Friday the other one. So thanks for watching, and bye.